SEVERE WEATHER NEWS NOW. WILD SPRING WEATHER IS UPON US, OF COURSE, AND LOCAL COUNTIES RIGHT NOW ARE GEARING UP FOR SEVERE WEATHER AWARENESS WEEK. IN BROWN COUNTY, A PREPAREDNESS PROCLAMATION WAS MADE BY COUNTY EXECUTIVE TROY STRECKENBACH. HE WAS JOINED BY THE COUNTY'S EMERGENCY MANAGEMENT DIRECTOR TO SHARE HOW THE COUNTY IS PREPARED FOR ANY SEVERE WEATHER, THINGS LIKE TORNADOES AND THOSE HEAVY STORMS. THERE WAS ALSO AN IMPORTANT REMINDER ABOUT SOME CHANGES TO THE ALERT SYSTEM THIS YEAR, PLANNING TO AIR SIRENS RATHER THAN TV AND RADIO BROADCASTS. We'll be doing two different ones, one in the afternoon at 1.45 and one in the evening at 6.45, where we will actually sound the sirens in Brown County. And we will be doing that in lieu of the Wednesday, the normal noon test. We're not going to be doing the Wednesday noon test. We'll be doing the two on Thursday. Well, they say they uh, wanted to get the message out earlier so families know how to plan ahead and let people know about some of the different alert systems that are out there. Obviously, technology changes, and that means a big difference, too. So, by the way, Severe Weather Awareness Week starts on Monday. Really just a good reminder for all of us, Chad. So I know that we're planning some stuff here at the station, but what other things should people maybe be thinking about? Yeah, definitely how to get those warnings. Yeah. I know the outdoor sirens are good if you're outside and near one, but at 3 a.m. and you're indoors, yeah. you probably won't be hearing that. So we really had to get our mind off of need to hear a siren to, hear, uh, to do something and have other ways of weather radio or, as we talk about every single day, get that Storm Team 5 weather app. That will send you alerts of watches and warnings, especially during severe weather, right to your phone. If you aren't near a, another radio or a TV, usually your phone is right next to you at night. So we have to start thinking about those things and, as I mentioned, get our mind off of having to hear a outdated tornado siren that might be miles away from your house for you to uh, get into your severe weather plans. Think about those severe weather plans right now. We don't have to wait until next week as we're getting closer to that severe weather season. And just have a kit, you know, things like some first aid uh, equipment, uh, some food and water, uh, a flashlight in case you lose power, just some of those things to think about as we get, again, closer to that severe weather season.